Well, day six and we're leaving Walmart. Had a great night's sleep. On with our adventure. Looks like we're gonna have a windy day. Like we're gonna get some sun, and the policeman just got him somebody. That sun looks so good. We found us a new home tonight. This is where we'll be staying tonight. Today was a long drive. How long did we drive today? Uh, 10 o'clock to 5. About 7 hours. Yeah, but tomorrow will be a shorter day. Mm. We're going in to get a few things. Talk to you later. This is where we spent the night. It's time to go. I just wanted to show you those beautiful mountains off in the distance. We had a peaceful night, good night's sleep. We thought the noise was going to bother us at first, but it didn't. We slept well. And we have a sunny day to travel. So we're looking at about 200 miles today, and then we're gonna stay there for a couple of days so uh, till next time later look at those mountains again Oop, let me zoom up on them again for you Beautiful. <laughs> to be going down the road cooking your dinner. I have some quinoa I bought looking good. 
all ready to go. All I have to do is fix a few vegetables to go with this. I bought this 12 volts crock pot so I could cook on down the road, but I got an adapter here and I can plug it in the wall. But normally you can just put it in the cigarette lighter. Love our being. Well, we made it to our new destination. This is where we'll be staying. And that's over there is the view out of our front window. We left Walmart uh, about 9.30 this morning and uh, when we got ready to get on the expressway, it was inclined and the coach seemed like it did not want to go. So uh, we went up this mountain about 25 miles an hour. We had to put the hazard lights on, but we made it. And we were looking for some place where we could um, get some help, but every place was closed. So we decided to keep on rolling. And when we came down the other side of the mountain, the coach got kind of fast. And it um, seemed like that did something because it started running a little better. So we made it here. We're going to get it checked out before we go any further. But until then, this is where we'll be. Nice, nice campground, nice people. We've been here before, in a few years, but we've stayed here before. But we may stay here a little longer. When we were here before, it was kind of cold, but today before we got here, it was like 82. So we might check out the area, stay a little longer. So until next time, our adventure continue. Well, today is moving day. We are moving over to the boondocking area for $6 a night. Well, this is our new home for the next couple of days. The view isn't as nice. But one thing I do like up here, they have made this little thing. I forget the name, but you walk around it. I have to check it out. I hope you can see it. The sun's awful bright. So we're boondocking in the out of bounds area, and this is nice because they have a dump station right there. We can still use the shower house and believe it or not, I can pick the internet up from over there. So for $6 a night, this is great. We'll be staying here for a few days. And now we're getting ready to load up and go to Mexico and have lunch. So I'll catch you guys later. Well, we made it to Mexico for lunch and I have to show you this washroom. I really like it. It is so cute. And look at the doors on the stalls. And let's see if you can see this. Here we are having lunch in Mexico. <laughs> Here's Leah. Have a great time.
lunch was very good.